pleasure for me to welcome you to the 2019 International Livestock Auctioneer Championships. We've got a great, uh, a great, great lineup here this afternoon. We've got some dignitaries to introduce. It's really loud, is it? Okay, we'll adjust that as we go. And don't be afraid to uh, let me know, guys, uh, as we get going here, because we don't need to make your ears bleed, Kelvin. Is that any better? Is that a little bit better? That's good. Hold it closer, you said, Kelvin. <laughs> Well, ladies and gentlemen, at this time, uh, for our opening ceremonies, we're going to start things off by uh, introducing uh, our contestants, and uh, we will bring in our representatives, and it's kind of a cool deal. We've got four countries represented again this year, so ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our representative from South Africa, Mr. Barco. I didn't even look at where it's at in here. Barco, come on in. We'll get his last name here a little bit later on. Anthony O'Dwyer from Australia. Give him a big Canadian welcome, absolutely. Corbett Wall is going to be leading in Team USA. And I don't think this next guy needs a lot of introduction. Everybody knows him here. Mr. Jordy Waters is going to bring in Team Canada. As our Canadians make their way into the ring, it's a pleasure for me to introduce uh, Constable Ben Dyke. And at this time, I'm going to call forward a young man that's going to lead us in O Canada. Ladies and gentlemen, this young fella, kind of a local celebrity around here. And I didn't get how old Jack is. Jack is five years old. Please welcome Mr. Jack Broomfield to lead us in O Canada. Good job, Jack. This time I'm going to call forward uh, some of our dignitaries to bring greetings. Our mayor, Mr. Gentry Hall, mayor of Staveley. Thank you, and thanks everybody for coming. I'd like to, on behalf of myself and the residents and the, and the rest of the council of Staveley, I'd like to... Uh, Welcome you all from everywhere. Um, being a rural community right here in the middle of southern Alberta, it's a very, this auction mark is a very important thing in our, in our town. They employ a lot of people. They support a lot of things. They support everything in town, actually. So, um, yeah, and I'd like to welcome you all, and thank you very much. Thank you, Mayor. I'd like to call forward Mr. Roger Reed. He's our MLA representing Livingstone McLeod. Well, good morning and welcome to the uh, most beautiful riding in the entire province of Alberta. It's good to be home. Um, we've had a long session up in uh, Edmonton, uh, working hard for the people of Alberta, so it's good to be here with real people. And uh, on behalf of the government and on behalf of the Premier of Alberta, 
Um, it's my privilege to bring you greetings and uh, welcome you to, uh, to Stavely. And uh, we want to wish all the best to our auctioneers today. I hope we have more buyers and auctioneers here today, so it's a good sale. And uh, enjoy your time in Stavely. Thank you. Our MP representing uh, Foothills, Mr. John Barlow. Thank you very much. Uh, it's a pleasure to be uh, back in Alberta after a long session in Ottawa. And I want to echo a lot of what Roger said. It's just nice to be home where there's a little bit of common sense. Uh, there's a lot, of, a lot of coconuts east of here, I will tell you that. But it really is uh, a pleasure to be having uh, such an incredible group of, of auctioneers here. I hope you uh, enjoy our Southern Alberta hospitality and thanks to, to Rob and your team at, here at Foothills Auctioneers uh, to be hosting this event here in Southern Alberta. Uh, you're bringing uh, the world of North America here to our constituency and that really means a lot to all of us that, that you're giving us an opportunity to showcase our amenities and certainly our hospitality. So I want to wish you all the best today, all the competitors, best of luck, the team here, uh, good luck and thank you everyone for, for coming here and enjoying a little bit of our Alberta culture and a little bit of that Alberta common sense. Thanks. And our next dignitary we would like to call forward, Mr. Dave Lance, uh, Board of Directors with the Calgary Stampede and Exhibition, as well as uh, David Ferrant, who is our uh, Director at Large with the Livestock Committee. Good morning, everyone, and uh, welcome on behalf of the Calgary Stampede. I'd just like to thank uh, the town of Stavely and the Stavely Auction Mart for, uh, for being our partners in this. We're very proud to be here. I know I am, and David is. At, uh, uh, as, a, as a farmer, this is the first time I've stood on this side of the uh, ring, and I'm, uh, I, could be, I could be bought, I guess. But uh, <laughs> anyway, uh, thank you very much for having us here, and uh, good luck to everyone, and a uh, uh, wonderful day. And we hope to see you all tomorrow at uh, Stampede. Thank you very much, Dave. Appreciate it very much. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a great contest lined up for you here this afternoon. And uh, just before we get underway, we have a few more uh, introductions that we would like to make. Uh, we'll give you a brief rundown on how the, uh, how the sale is going to be, uh, be marked today. Uh, so each one of these contestants, when they come in this afternoon, they're going to be judged on uh, criteria, which you will find on page four of your catalog if you do have that. But they're going to be uh, judged on spotting the bids, their rhythm, their clarity, their voice control, how they conduct a sale, their ability to spot those bids, and bottom line is would you hire this auctioneer to work for you. We've got uh, five extremely capable individuals that are going to be marking uh, these gentlemen today and I'm going to introduce them to you. If you'd hold your applause until we introduce all five, would be absolutely spectacular. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, from uh, Monarch, Alberta, Mr. Conrad uh, Werheg. Where's Conrad at? There he is. Withage. Isn't that what it said? Okay. Uh, from Stetler, Alberta, Mr. Jim Abel. Jim's right up top here. From Moose Jaw, Saskatchewan, Tyler Friesen. Your 2010 World Livestock Auctioneer Champion from Lewistown, Montana, Mr. Kyle Schaub. And a great, great friend of the committee, and he was your 2010 International Livestock Auctioneer Champion, uh, former uh, chairman of the board with the LMA, ladies and gentlemen, from uh, Kansas City, it says, but I call him from Creston, Iowa, Mr. Tom Fry, 2010 International Champion. We appreciate that very much, gentlemen. I'm going to excuse our contestants because I know they're going to be getting ready, so, so we'll head them out the door. Uh, I'd like to recognize our sponsors this afternoon. An event like this doesn't take place without uh, all our sponsors, and we certainly appreciate all the folks that have given us a hand. They're going to be in your catalog. If you see them, you give those people a big thank you. Uh, Cudlobe Angus, I'm not sure if we've got a representative here. We do have the great folks from Cudlobe Angus, one of our sponsors here today. Uh, I know Doug is here, Doug Bidlock with uh, High Hog. Doug has been a great, great uh, representative, been with us for many, many years. Appreciate you very much, Doug. Uh, representing LIS, I'm not sure who, if Cam is here. Cool livestock calling, and of course, the members of the Alberta Auction Markets Association. Uh, real quickly, I would like to introduce to you our committee. And our committee makes this thing click, and we've got a great set of volunteers that, uh, that are very, very dedicated to this committee. Uh, I, I'm going to get these folks to rise as well. If you'd hold your applause until after we introduce our entire committee. Our, uh, our chair, Mr. Scott McKinnon. Our first vice chair, uh, Connie Hackway. Brian Dainard. Rob Bergevin. Patrick Cassidy. Dale Dola. 
uh, Ben Payne, Tanya Hagel, Chance Martin, Allison Mosca, Greg Sanderson, Ron Ward, Marty Ward, who is our past chair. Uh, you met Conrad, one of our judges already. Uh, you met David Farron, our chair of the livestock uh, competition. Dave Lance, director liaison, and Julie Garvey. Let's give those folks a big round of applause. Before I do our next set of introductions, there's one real special guy that moment of your time. Ladies and gentlemen, we lost a really good friend of ours. He was uh, a former committee member, Mr. Bruce Hepburn. And Bruce was on this committee for many, many years, an absolute gentleman, and uh, was as dedicated to this contest as anybody. Ladies and gentlemen, if you would please rise and remove cover in a moment's silence in honor of our good friend, Mr. Bruce Hepburn. Thank you very much. Our condolences to the Hepburn family, great gentleman, and uh, certainly going to be missed on our committee. Uh, one other gentleman that I would like to introduce, as I mentioned, uh, as, as far as our, our contestants, they are going to be uh, receiving, our champion is going to receive a big cash prize. He's going to get a buy into the World Livestock Auctioneer Championships. And I'd like to uh, introduce to you this time Mr. Forrest Magnin here representing LMA out of Kansas City. Glad to have you with us again, Forrest. If anybody knows of a fishing hole on Sunday, he's still looking. Uh, also like to introduce some of our past champions. And I do know that we do have our 1991 International Livestock Auctioneer Champion. I don't see him right now, but I know he's here. A good friend of ours, committee, former committee member. Where are you at, Brant? Brant Hurlbert. Brant's right down here. Give Brant a big round of applause. We're going to fast track ahead to 2007. One of our international uh, committee members, Mr. Chance Martin. Of course, you met one of our judges, or 2010 International Livestock Auctioneer Champion, Mr. Tom Fry. And a young man that we are extremely, extremely proud of and uh, represented us really well last year at the World Livestock Auctioneer Championships. He's your outgoing champion, Mr. Ryan Kaninenbelt. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think without further ado, we're going to get underway with the sale. As far as our buyers are concerned, uh, this is a uh, regular sale. However, we are going to be selling cattle to you. As you see, the cattle have been sorted up uh, extremely tight. So uh, there are going to be no cuts this afternoon. These gentlemen are going to sell seven drafts of cattle. And uh, if there is an absolute issue that needs to be dealt with, we'll deal with it after, after the contest. Uh, but, uh, but there will be no cuts this afternoon. Our first contestant, if he wants to make his way to the block, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome from North Platte, Nebraska, Mr. Kyle Lehman. Kyle was born and raised on a farm and ranch in Nebraska, and he attended the World Worldwide College of Auctioneering in Mason City, Iowa, seven years ago. He's been a full-time livestock auctioneer for the last six years, selling livestock at four to six markets a week. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome contestant number one, Mr. Kyle Lehman. Well, thank you, Danny. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. It's certainly a privilege to be uh, back here in Canada. I always enjoy coming up here visiting my northern neighbors. It's certainly a pleasure. I'd like to thank all the judges for making their way. I know a lot of the judges traveled pretty far. I'd like to thank all the consigners and buyers for being here today. With no further ado, ladies and gentlemen, the auction's on here, here, gonna roll cows on down here. How many dollars on her? Who up here? Ninety dollar here to one. One here to one, two, two, one, two, three. Ninety-four, four dollar here to nine, five dollar here to six, here to seven, seven dollar here to eight, dollar dollar one, dollar two, dollar here to three, dollar dollar four dollar dollar five dollar here to six, here to seven, seven dollar here to eight, dollar 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 Fourteen, fourteen, and now fifteen, and now fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, seventeen, and now eighteen here. 
Pardon me, 19, 18, 19, 20. And now one, 